Hey guys, I'm back with another GoPro tips and tricks video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can add an effect to your GoPro Studios Edit where the video goes backwards for a brief period of time before going forwards again. This is a pretty cool looking edit and you do see it a fair bit in video. So I thought I'd show you guys how you can add a very similar effect here in GoPro Studios. We've got our video clip here. A little bit, bit of skiing. So first we're gonna put in a little bit of video just going forwards. So we'll go from there to here. Then we'll set an out point. We'll drag that down onto the timeline. Then I'm thinking I'm probably gonna go for a little bit of slow motion next. So I wanna slow the video down before I make it go backwards. So I'm then gonna move, um, we'll click here make this the in point so that's the same point that way the two clips will line up perfectly I can then play all right we'll make a bit shorter than that probably make it this long set the out point you can drag that onto the timeline and you can see that when we play it through it plays through flawlessly so you don't even notice the gap between the two video clips then what we're going to do here is go up to speed we're going to take it down to 25 percent, be two and a five, and now it'll go slow for this period of the video. When it gets to the end, I want it to go backwards. So I'm going to have to go back into my clip here. I can then just click on it. I can go copy, put my um, selector at the end, push control V, get that exact same clip again. Now the important point here is that out point. If I want to make the whole thing shorter, I can drag the in point closer to the out point, making sure my speed is still slow. I can then just hit reverse. And then lastly, I want to take this clip one more time, this same clip, copy it, Pasting it at the end, I'm going to hit the uncheck the reverse. The important point again is now the end point, and I can drag that end point out as far as I would like. And then I'm also at this point going to take off my slowdown, making this back to 100%. Now if you play through the video here, we'll go back to the beginning. On our timeline, we'll push play. We can see that when the video gets to this first clip, it slows down. And then here, it's going to turn around. It's going to go backwards. And then it's going to go back forwards and speed up again. If you want to make this a little bit better, we could uncheck or unmute the audio from all of the clips. And then maybe insert some audio, perhaps from YouTube's free library of music. So guys, check out my little edit. Um, and Thank you for watching. This was a very quick video showing you how you can add some effects in GoPro Studios. It may not be the most um, elegant way to add this kind of effect in an editing software, but even using something as limited as GoPro Studios, you have a lot of creative power. Thank you guys for watching this other GoPro tips and tricks video. If you've enjoyed it, please make sure you subscribe and check out my channel for lots more options. If you guys like the video, please go ahead and like it. It means a lot and it really helps me to continue bringing you videos like this. Until next time, guys. Oh, if you've got any questions or comments, leave them below. And I do respond and read every single one of those. So thanks for doing that. And I'm totally lost. But most of all, guys, thanks for watching.